Welcome back to our channel. In today's episode, we're tackling an issue that many server owners and players have faced, vehicles being used unrealistically to ram each other, commonly known as Vehicle Deathmatch (VDM). To address this and enhance the realism within our server, we're introducing a game-changing addition, a realistic car damage and accident script. This innovative script is designed to bring a more realistic behavior to vehicle handling and consequences on our server, significantly reducing the instances of unrealistic driving and improving the overall gameplay experience. I'm Brave, and I'm here to guide you through the implementation of this critical script, ensuring our server not only offers entertainment, but also maintains a fair and authentic gameplay environment. To kick off this thrilling enhancement, make your way to the GitHub download page for both scripts showcased in the video. You'll find the links conveniently located in the video description, ensuring easy access. Upon reaching the site, download each package individually and then proceed to unzip the files. Afterward, copy and paste the contents into the server repository of your choice. To keep everything organized, consider renaming each folder by removing the main suffix. When you navigate to the engine stalling script folder, you'll be greeted by the config file, ready for your personal touch. To ensure that the introduction of realistic car damage and engine stalling scripts enhances the gameplay without causing frustration among players, I've decided to implement minimal changes, particularly by adjusting the minimum speed threshold higher. It's important to note that the speed settings in these scripts are given in MPH, allowing for a straightforward conversion and understanding for those familiar with this speed measurement. After carefully adjusting the engine stalling script to strike the right balance between realism and playability, our next step involves diving into the configuration for the BBV Realistic Damages script. For the BBV Realistic Damages script configuration, it's important to note that the speed settings are specified in KMP, kilometers per hour, which requires a different consideration for adjustments compared to MPH. This distinction ensures that any changes made to the speed thresholds are accurately reflected in the gameplay, catering to a global audience familiar with either measurement system. In this configuration, the term no brake indicates that vehicles classified under certain categories will not incur damage through the typical interactions dictated by this script. Recognizing the essential role of emergency vehicles within the server, I've decided to include the emergency class in this exemption list. To accurately classify and exempt emergency vehicles, it's necessary to consult the vehicle classification list within QB core slash shared slash vehicles. Please note the slow motion effect shown in the video is done by video editor and not a feature. Testing the script is a crucial step in ensuring that the realistic car damage and accident mechanics are functioning as intended within the server. With the configuration set, the script now dictates that any vehicle collision with an entity in-game at speeds exceeding 150 kmp has a slight chance of resulting in wheel detachment. Additionally, to simulate the disorienting effect of a high-impact crash, players will experience a dizzy effect lasting for 10 seconds coupled with the vehicle's engine shutting off for 5 seconds. The same consequences apply to scenarios where vehicles are used to perform unrealistic jumps, aiming to curb behaviors that detract from the immersive experience of the server. By implementing these detailed effects, we aim to enhance the depth of the gameplay, making each driving decision and maneuver a matter of skill and consideration, thereby improving the overall quality and realism of the server environment. And that concludes our walkthrough on implementing the realistic car damage and accident script into our 5M server. With these adjustments, we've introduced a layer of realism that not only enriches the gameplay experience, but also encourages responsible driving practices among players. If you found this video useful and are interested in more content like this, make sure to hit the like button, share with your friends, and subscribe to our channel. Your support motivates us to continue creating helpful and engaging content for the 5M community. I'm Brave, signing off for now. Thank you for joining me on this journey to create a more realistic and engaging 5M server. Stay tuned for more updates, tips, and tutorials to keep enhancing your gaming experience. 
Until next time, drive safely and enjoy the immersive world of 5M. A quick update on our Discord community. The Exquis, previously a separate entity within our main Discord, has now been integrated into a single unified platform. I'm thrilled to introduce Codin, our dedicated 5M developer hub. With over 650 active users and developers, Codin serves as a vibrant space for those seeking assistance and those eager to lend their expertise. In an effort to streamline support and collaboration, I've restructured the Discord to cater to specific frameworks, making it easier for members to find the help they need. Additionally, I've set up forums where I'll be sharing my latest videos directly, ensuring you have hassle-free access to new script links without the interruption of ads. A extra user forum also provide a space for members to exchange free scripts, request videos on specific topics, and we also have developers who create custom vehicles and Vinewood logo sign from scratch. Coden is not just a hub for sharing knowledge. It's a community where creativity and collaboration thrive. We're also on the lookout for moderators to help maintain a supportive and engaging environment. So, if you're passionate about 5M development, eager to learn, share, or simply be part of an active developer community, Coden is the place for you. Join us and be part of our growing 5M developer hub. Your journey to mastering 5M development starts here.